Um, in 1969, uh, my younger brother came back from Vietnam. He was in the uh, Tet Offensive and Air Cavalry and been in combat for a year. And he came to Pullman on his, he'd only been out of a firefight about a week. You know, he a little layover in, in uh, Hawaii and he was here. And I, we had grown up fishing. So I said, well, well, I'll take you fishing in the morning. And he said, well, don't. Don't come into the bedroom, you know, don't make any noise. I've been sleeping in a jungle and with a weapon and so. Anyway, I still have, I have a photograph of that trip. I took him down to Wawaii Canyon and we hiked downstream a ways a couple of miles and then fished for a smallmouth bass that time of year. And uh, there was something about seeing him out of combat suddenly on a river and I don't know, some kind of soul restoration thing was going on. And, uh, it was very. It was an important thing. He has never forgotten that. We still fish together all these years later. But um, uh, I have a picture of sort of early in the morning, little mist coming off the river, and uh, and I, I don't remember what fish we caught. I know we caught a lot of fish. But it was. It's just one of those things. You lock them down. They don't go away. You know?